Hi, I'm Joseph Huddle with Huddle Landscape Architecture for landscapingnetwork.com. On this particular project, we use bamboo for perimeter screening. And it's, uh, bamboo is very useful on a small project in particular because when you need perimeter screening, if you use a regular shrub, sometimes they're not very exciting to look at. And so um, bamboo, if you have a, a limited space, bamboo is both a visual barrier but also a visual interest with the canes. Uh, if you were to use a regular, um, say, a pittosporum or a, or a loris, you'd have this hedge screening with no real interest and you'd have to have additional plants in front of that to provide interest. Uh, with bamboo, if you have just a four foot width, you can have a plant that's both screening and then also the canes can be pruned up to provide visual interest as well. Now with bamboo, you have to be careful about which variety you use. Uh, bamboo is usually put into two categories. You have clumping bamboo and running bamboo. What we have here is a, a, a black bamboo, which is one of the runners. It's a great bamboo, but if you don't have root control, uh, you're going to invite problems. So in this situation, this bamboo is bound by two concrete walls, which it absolutely cannot escape from. When you do not have root barriers, a useful bamboo to use would be a clumping bamboo. Uh, my favorite varieties would be in the bambusa family, the bambusa genus, and uh, Alphonse Carr would be my number one choice, depending on the size you have. Golden Goddess is another good one. There is also fern leaf, and there's some larger bambusas such as Toldoides and Textilis, which are really striking but need a bit more room because their root ball will end up being about uh, five or six feet wide at least. I'm Joseph Huddle for landscapingnetwork.com. Thanks for watching.